Hello and welcome to our July edition of our Movers and Shakers newsletter where we'll be bringing you the roundup of the HR tech news um, from our wonderful industry. So we'll start off with Deal. So Deal is a name we're hearing more and more of. They're growing very aggressively and they are an HR and payroll platform and announced this month that they've acquired Hoffi, which is an end-to-end -end IT services platform. So rather than going down the finance route as they try and to enter the enterprise space, they're going down the IT route. So they'll be able to offer their customers end-to-end -end IT services along with HR um, and they'll be calling that Deal IT one to watch out for. Um, a big congratulations to Zealous, who won Payroll Provider of the Year at the Global Payroll Awards. So part of that award was based on their ability to innovate, um, which makes sense because this month they also launched Zealous Air, which is a combination of um, the power of AI with real-time payroll processing. Um, so part of the award was also based on their ability to provide cost effectiveness for their team. So I imagine Zealous Air is just going to continue to support customers down their cost effective route. So well done to Zealous on that one. We've had some people changes announced. So Dayforced announced that Nicole Bello will be joining them as their group VP of EMEA. She comes from UKG. Um, and also Lattice, which is an AI powered platform, have announced they have a new CPO. Gianna Driver. So well done, guys, on your new jobs. We're here to support you. Um, while we're talking about UKG, um, they have also announced they're having some quite large scale redundancies. Same with Intuit. They've also announced redundancies. And this is just um, a result of changes of directions for these companies and some restructuring. I mean, like every company around the world, we're all looking at ways we can make ourselves more efficient. And that is part of that. So our thoughts are with all of those that will be impacted and losing their jobs through that process. And to finish, <clears throat> we'll talk about Workday. So we thought the news was big enough that they have launched um, a collaboration with Salesforce. They're teaming up with Salesforce to be able to offer businesses some real true business in insights into all their performance data, which crosses HR, payroll, finance, and now data from their CRM which will be really fascinating to see, but also it's going to enable employees to um, have access to an instant AI employee service agent, they're calling it, where you will be able to gather data from all platforms using an AI assistant as an employee. So that's a fascinating one. But as if that wasn't interesting enough, they've also announced they will be launching a Netflix documentary. Let's see if they can make HR tech sexy. Um, they're teamed up with the Spring Hill, Hill Company to launch a documentary called Untapped, Closing America's Opportunity Gap. So let's see what that has to bring. Uh, there's lots of other news in our newsletter. So if you don't want to miss out on future ones, then make sure you subscribe. If not, all the links to everything I've talked about will be below. Have a great month, everyone.